Welcome to the basics of spreadsheet lesson. Spreadsheets have columns and they have rows and they allow you to keep numbers and organize and analyze them. I've got a question I want you to solve. There is a number 15 on the screen. What column is it in? Hopefully, it was obvious to you that that was column B. I've got another question for you. The name Anita is on the screen. What row is that in? You should have said row 5. There is also an 8 on the screen. I need you to use the column and the row to tell me its exact location. Hopefully you said C5 because that is the address where it exists. I'm going to show you a couple of cool tricks. This is called selecting so I can do something to a lot of uh, values at once. And I want to take these TVs and I want to center them. So I'm going to look down my more list and I'm going to find the horizontal alignment and then I want to use the center tool. I want that same format for the word cars. So I'm going to use a new button called the paint format to paint that center value right here. I'm going to make a new column out here called total sales. And we need to build a formula to count the total sales. Do you know what key you press before you start any formula? After trying that, you should have figured out its equals. I'm going to hit my equals, click on the 10, hit the plus, click on the 1, and when I press enter, it does the math. If I look at this formula, by clicking its box, I can see that even though the number 11 appears, it is really doing B2 plus C2. Do you know the name of this amazing little handle? It is the autofill. And when you've created a formula and you grab autofill, it will calculate it all the way across. So remember how it was B2, C2 for the first one? For the next one, it's B3 and C3. Do you know what the amazing keys are that can show you all the formulas at once? It is the control tilde, and it shows you all the formulas that you've used so far in one quick step. And you just hit control tilde again to make it go away. If we choose more, we can also use the amazing functions. When you click that choice, it gives you several functions to pick from. I'm going to choose the sum function. And I'm going to calculate the sum of column C. Notice it's got a blinking selection inside the parentheses. It's asking you what you want to get the sum of. So you just grab the cells that you care about and you press enter. I'm going to do that same thing again super quick. Function tool, sum, grab the ones I care about and press enter. And it automatically calculates the sum. Hopefully now, you're feeling more confident about the basics of spreadsheets.